Coming down into the weird hall, walking into our door, it takes you into a whole nother realm and brings you into medieval fantasy for the evening. I grew up in high school reading medieval fantasy, Tolkien, and like wishing that I could go to somewhere like that. It's definitely an escape. You can immerse yourself into something else for the night or for the day. You have elves or you have pirates. You hear the clink, 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 clink of chain mail. It really feels like a medieval, like you're in a whole nother realm. This place is just amazing. I love the look of it, the sound of it. It, it feels like I'm someplace else and someone else. You just get this completely different world feeling here that I love. In 2018, we got our first little shop over in Milwaukee and then found this place last summer. Spent all summer building it out. So I think they were doing like a pioneer themed bar. And when we first came in, you know, there's only like one or two lights working down here. And it was full of antiques and like old stuff from like the old business, the hutch that used to be here. But I saw all the woods, all the stuff that was here. I'm like, well, this will make a really great space for it. Everything we make for our mead is made on site. I mean, it's one of the oldest fermentable beverages in the world. Um, all different um, cultures and like regions have their own style of mead. Mead is made with honey. Instead of using grapes as your primary sugar source, we're using honey, and we use local organ honey here. Uh, we're pretty big mead fans, so it's nice to have something like this in Portland now. It is delicious. It's amazing. Oh my god, I love it. <laughs> yeah, awesome place. One of my favorite places in Portland so far. Yeah. I do leather work, make all sorts of armor pieces, belts, garb, medieval fantasy armor. We have like almost like a little artist alley happening alongside the leather working. During normal retail hours, you can wander in, browse leather goods, browse local artists, and also pick up a bottle and take it to go. Friday, Saturday, Sunday, we do our hall nights in here. We got food, we got drink, stuff that you would maybe find in a medieval tavern. So the web of weird, the Norns in Norse mythology wove the web. It kind of represents past, present, future. We're weird and Portland is weird, so if you want to hang out in a real-life medieval tavern, this is, this is the vibe that we got going here.